Welcome to our channel, True Radiations, where content meets reality. This video will give the answers to the below questions. What is CSD? What is data science? Top 5 programming languages taught in this course? Why this branch is introduced in bachelor's degree? List of top data science companies? Average salary of CSD engineers? At last a valuable conclusion. A big thanks to Unacademy for sponsoring this video. If you're preparing for IMSA 2021, then Unacademy is the best platform for you. Daily live classes are happening on their platform. The best thing is, they are absolutely free. The link is there in the description box. These are India's top educators who are teaching on Unacademy. Let's begin. So, what is CSD? CSD is a new branch, which is being offered by many colleges this year. CSD is an integration of computer science and data science. Before it was just a specialization in computer science. But now, it's being taught in a bachelor's degree. The reason is, due to an increase in demand. So, what is data science? In simpler terms, data science is a branch of study which involves obtaining meaningful insights from raw and unstructured data. The colossal amount of data is processed through programming, analytical and business skills. Data science is a multidisciplinary field that uses scientific methods, processes, algorithms to produce knowledge and insights from structured and unstructured data. It utilizes techniques and theories derived from many fields such as computer science, mathematics, statistics and information science. Now, let's see the top 5 programming languages for data science in 2020. First comes Python. Then JavaScript, then Scala. R. SQL. Why this branch is introduced in bachelor's degree. As we know that, it was just a specialization till now. But now, it got integrated with CSE. It is because the demand for data science is increasing day by day, and industry needs engineers who are experts in data science. I personally want to hire an engineer who is an expert in data science. Colleges started teaching data science in their bachelor's degrees itself. So, students can get hired as soon as they complete their bachelor's degree. Here is a practical view of its demand from Google Trends. This is how its demand got increased in the past five years. By seeing the graph it is sure that the demand for this branch will definitely get increases in the future. Let's see the list of top data science companies worldwide in 2020. Oracle. Numerator. Cloudera. Splunk. Spins. Alteryx. Civis Analytics. And many more. So, what will be the average package of an engineer with a specialization in data science? I won't say it from my side. Let's see it practically. This is the survey conducted by Glassdoor.co. Yes, this is the average salary of a data science engineer. It's around 9.5 lakh rupees per annum. It means around 80k rupees per month. These are the top renowned companies and their salaries for data science engineers. If you want to note them down, then kindly pause this video and take a screenshot or you can note them down from description box, it is available in the description box. Finally coming to conclusion, I can just say that, this branch is having a high demand now, and I'm sure that, this branch will have, huge demand in future, because everything is becoming automated and storing data and arranging them in a systematic format is a real challenge. So there is no chance of having no jobs, in data science. The next era, is for data science, machine learning, and artificial intelligence, engineers. If you have any doubts, then feel free to ask them, in the comment box, we'll definitely reply, to each and every comment, within 24 hours. If this video was useful for you, then please do like this video, which really motivates us, in making new videos. And if you are new to our channel, then please do subscribe to our channel. It's just a click from your side, but it brings great value to our channel. And make sure to turn on the bell icon, to receive further updates from us.